क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोज फ्रॉम इकीडा हेलो फ्रेंड्स एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी द न्यू सिग्नल दैट इज कॉल्ड एज यूनिट इम्पल्स सिक्वेंस दिस यूनिट इम्पल्स फंक्शन दैट वी हैव स्टडीड इन कंटिन्यूस टाइम डोमेन एंड द कमिंग टॉपिक इज यूनिट इम्पल्स सिक्वेंस बोथ आर सेम बोथ आर सेम ओनली द चेंज इज रिप्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ इक्वेशन दैट्स इट बोथ आर सेम नाउ हाउ द रिप्रेजेंटेशन चेंजेस विल सी एंड द प्लॉट will draw the same as it is we have plotted in continuous time also so let's draw the graph first and we'll study the equations after one here this function is represented by del of n and this function is only available for or this function is only available at n equals to 0 so at n equals to 0 this function is having amplitude 1 then you can say that this function is unit impulse function now the topic is unit for impulse sequence sequence in short there is a number of sequence or number of bits present in this graph how to obtain that number of sequences or number of amplitudes in this graph we'll study we have we are going to study the uh, topic in the next uh, videos that is time shifting property in this uh, in that property we sh we are going to shift all the sequences by some amount of time and that function is represented by some different uh, ca characters we'll see that function but first of all we'll study the equation or representation of this graph so del of n is represented by 1 and having which is having amplitude 1 for n equals to 0 and when n is not equals to 0 amplitude is 0 now in just few minutes few seconds before of what i said we have to produce a sequence if you want to produce a sequence we are going to shift this time or we are going to shift this pulse by some amount for that you should know the time shifting property so you are going to study that part later on but first of all how this graph looks like like how this sequence is looks like and how to produce that graph so we'll see how that graph is plotted or looks like this is del of n which is delayed by let's say n not n not is any integer value if we delay this graph or advance this graph by some value then you will get this type of sequence if this sample is delayed by 1 or 2 or 3 and so on means what you will get this type of equation so if your graph is delayed by 1 then the sample will be available at 1 similarly if you delay this graph by 2 your sample will be available at 2 and so on similarly if you advance this graph by 1 2 3 then your graph will be looks like this but in all the stages the amplitude of this graph remains same and it is 1 this amplitude will remain same it will not going to change throughout the time period understood so this is the way to represent this graph whereas this n not is any integer value means this value can be have a positive values also as well as negative values also so don't worry about it this sequence is basically used for to sample any continuous time signals if we want a sample sampled form of any graph we are going to simply multiply this delta function or impulse function with the given graph so that the product is always available in the sampled version 
सो थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो स्टेट इन विथ ई कीडा एंड सब्सक्राइब ई कीडा फॉर नेक्स्ट फ्यूचर वीडियोज़